Hello everyone, I'm Greycloak, thank you for joining me, and welcome back to episode 23 of Basin. Yes. Mm. So we were out looking for some resources last episode, the last couple of episodes, while also doing some crashes and repairing our stuff. Um, and we found some magnesium. We didn't find any gold as far as I remember. But we don't really need that, at least not yet. I do sort of think that this whole vehicle is a waste of time though. It can't be used for anything else than just looking for resources, but we might as well just build a mining platform that could fly around at that point. Which I think is something we're going to have to do soon. Maybe in this episode, maybe in the next. Mm. Yeah. But first of all, I want to make a medical room kit. What is what called? One of these. Medical room, yeah. Because then we have somewhere to respawn if we should ever die. Which I'm getting more and more afraid of doing. We could just load, of course, but as always, that seems a bit cheaty. So. Let's put this on. Well, where do we want to put this though? What sort of connections do we have? One on the bottom, one on the top, and that's it. Okay. Hmm, we could just put it up here, I guess. I just feel like it's more realistic to have it on my way I can walk to it. We could just put a junction, a conveyor junction down here, put it right there, that seems okay. We don't really have to use the space for anything else anyway. Let's do that. <coughs> and that means of course we'll have to make this a junction as well. So we need some more small steel tubes, interior plate, and construction composition. Oops. And we haven't got any of that in here. We have to get our welding ship. I'm not sure we can get that down there though. So let's just grab the... Well, we might as well fly this down anyway. Oh, this is heavier than I remember. Have we lowered the power of the gyroscopes on this? 100%, 100%? Oh well. It's just very slow to move. I'm moving my mouse from, well, from side to side of my mouse pad with this. And it's just not moving at all. Oh well. Let's get over here. Oh yeah, we planned these batteries a long time ago. Maybe we should try and finish those as well. If we have the materials at least. I think we need some more power cells for this. Yeah, power cells needed. Okay. And for that. Okay. Mm. What are our assemblers doing at the moment? All sort of good, good stuff. I guess we might as well set our slave to do some of these. Actually, they're not, not that many. Never mind. Say something that's okay, I think. We need them both for a mining rig and a, our spaceship. Which we are still planning. So iron seems to be a bit in the short supply at the moment. Is that just because one of the refineries is refining cobalt? I guess it is. We should have enough stone to keep them going for a while. And yeah, this hole has gotten quite deep already. 
and we can make it even evil. Well, I guess we should really use the stone we have already before we flood all of our storage with stone. We don't really want that. Why isn't this being used? That's valuable material. Okay. Do we have some of these ready? Yeah, we can only carry so many though, but... Can make a bit more room, Well, I think we'll have three more. Two more, okay. This is stupid, but hey, let me. Let's not finish these right now, anyway. We needed the steel pipe and construction composition. And some more material plate. Let's just grab that. And then I think we can reach the rest with the ship. Even if it is a bit in the corner here. Good. I need another junction just because I don't want just a pipe sticking up from here because you can see it underneath the medical room. Is this the right pad up? It's hard to see, but it looks like there's a keyboard underneath that screen, so it should be fine. The only problem with this is that now we'll actually finish some of the light armor blocks that we're using for the floor, but maybe that's okay. We'll live with it at least. Oh, what? Apparently I can... That was pretty surgical, only finishing the stuff we actually wanted to finish. That surprised me quite a lot. Maybe we don't have any steel plates in this? Is that why? Yeah, of course we did. I wouldn't be that good, good at anything really. So we need medical composition, yeah. or components or whatever it's like called. These things. Uh, not those things, these. How many did we need? 15, and we need another 15 for our spaceship, so let's just make those as well. And they require silver, so we have to go and find silver now. Okay. Is there a smaller medical room or something we can... Survival kit. We can build one of those and step one out to respawn it. I think that is the thing for us to be doing. And I guess we'll just. There's just these two parts, yeah. We will just place that over here, but this way. Steel plate needed. Let's finish that with our welder. If we can squeeze in between here. And what do we need for this? Also medical what? So we do require silver before we can get a respawn point apparently. Okay. I wasn't aware. Let's tear this down again. Right?
Oh, that sucks a bit. I guess we'll just have to go and find the silver now. Oh, mine the silver. I think we have some mark on a GPS code. Mm -hmm. Hello, yeah, okay. Never mind. No problem. Let's hide these for now. And let's get the bib up. And up. Good. Is there anything we should fix before going? No. No reason. Is this yep. by any chance full of stone? Yes, it is. Mm. It did feel pretty heavy while lifting off from here, so that's why. I... Oh, and it's damaged apparently from our great disaster, the mining rig. So what is it? Is it just the battery? Yeah. Okay. That is fine. We do need to get rid of all the stone in here though. This should be the other container on the ship, I think. So now we should be empty. Whoops. And yeah, we are. Good. Let's grab some silver. Thing we marked these earlier while looking for the resources. That makes it a lot easier now, at least. Good, let's see if we can remember these controls. I guess we only really need these. ships from the outside, I just wanted to have a look at this, because this is not something I actually look at that often, how it looks from the outside, and how we're doing, one is just about full, whoops, This is a lot harder from the outside though, so when we get this top part off, I think we'll just go inside and control from there. It's just so noisy in here, and I apologize for that, but that's just how it is. And also, we need to not put forwards too much, not put those down too much, because well, we haven't got the drop to keep us from falling. 
our inventory is cooking. They are full. Oh, almost full, sorry. Let's just finish it then. Almost there. This will be fine. Just making sure that it is just the battery smoking. And it is. So what did we get actually? 8,000, 16,000 whereabouts still. That is fine. And that's liters, I guess. Or was that kilograms? No, that, yeah, that's kilograms, okay. Wait, what? Okay, yeah. We just have to remember that we are not very good at slowing down or heaving ourselves up really, so we will have to give ourselves a good amount of space to do that. And I guess we'll just start breaking now. Oh, I guess we'll try and leave it around 45 meters per second. Good, we can break now. Good, and then we need to go down without getting too much speed. And I just want to make sure that we are somewhat level. Oh dear, was that too much? Please stop. Oh boy, <laughs> that was close. Maybe it's better if we use this logging board down here so we don't crash with the turbines. At least for now while we are pretty heavy. Let's do that. And flush all of this out. just want to keep my resources somewhat organized here so we have stone in the container. I guess we can just put it together with the silver in this one. Let's put all of this cobalt after all of the other resources. Because I think we have more cobalt than we will need in quite a while. So now we're refining all of the silver. That might also be a bad idea to refine this much because well, we won't be doing any iron then. Good. So now we should have some silver for our medical components. Three done. A lot more silver needed apparently. Okay. That is fine. We'll wait a bit. I guess we, in the meantime, can just get some power cells into this welder. Might as well take these as well, actually. Power cell. And go and finish those. Whoop. Ah. Dang it. I was not very good at hitting the right buttons there. But finishing those two or three batteries, however many they were. Oh, so slow. Oh, 
three batteries. Okay, okay. How far are we with the medical kits? Another four, so we have eight now. That's not enough. I guess we can start on our vertical mining rig. So we want to do something like or a frame, something like this. At least with this sort of power production. Of course, that will have to be above all of our storage. And we want a mining drill in the middle like this. Of course, this is all experimental because I haven't done this before, but it'll be fun. Hopefully. And without too many crashes. Oh, destroying of things. Do we have a level area where we can build somewhere? Is this, yeah, this is also sloped. Mm, I guess we can just build out here and not have everything touch the ground. We need some steel plate first, though. I guess we'll just start with one corner going up. I don't know how tall we want this building to be, or this rig to be, really. We obviously want the mining drills to be able to reach pretty deep, but we can do that in other ways than just one straight line. At least I hope we can. Well, let's just start with this, I guess. Now, do we actually want this to be sort of... Uh, well, human usable? Do we want a big platform up here that we can walk around and access the storage? Or do we just want the storage containers to be embedded in this and just have a cockpit somewhere that we're actually going to use? Mm, I'm not sure about that actually. Actually, we don't want it to be too big, we have to remember that. But then again, we need enough space to have a lot of turbines on it. So how about we plan out... I think we'll go with just having the storage embedded in it and just having access to a cockpit for us. Where is the storage? There it is. And we need internal plate. Let's grab that. So, even if we have space for more storage, we don't really want that much storage because that is also a lot more weight and we don't want it to be too heavy again. Because we do have to fly this around. But that also makes me think that it would be Makes more sense if we just made a platform that we could actually walk around. How 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 deep do we want to go with this? Do we want to have refining on this as well? Maybe even an assembler? A whole mobile base basically. Mm. We could also plan to be able to expand to that and just start with the basics. Good questions. Let's we'll start by just getting some of it done. One, two, three, four, five, six. Storm seven. Inbound. More meteors, oh dear. So 
how much space do we have between these? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And then we have a bit less space on the other, other axis, but that is okay. We can just go with a square setup for this. Okay, doesn't seem like we're getting hit by anything here. So we need 15. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. And then another pillar. Good, so these will be our... Whoops. You low. Low, low fuel. Great. Fuel critical. Let's grab some more fuel before we continue this. Also, we can probably finish our medical room now. So I think we'll do that first. Good. Please fill up my suit with flour. Thank you. We have to get the medical components in here. Take the uh, another 19 there. Do we have another one somewhere? Nope. Didn't we finish the last one then? I mean, we have enough to finish the medical room for now, but. Okay, now it's done. I just don't want to have to grab these again. There we go. Also, we might as well repair this battery on the back of our miner. Great. Don't want to crash into our 3D printer there. And that is done. Good. This. I think this is enough to get this as our respawn point, right? Is it not connected to anything? I don't get any hydrogen from this. So this is connected to the refinery behind it, and that should be connected to these tanks. And we do have hydrogen. This should be enough to respawn here, right? Or do we need a cryo chamber? Hmm. I'm not sure about that. I think we should. Oh, I should look into that between episodes. I don't know why I don't get any hydrogen from this, though. We should have access to everything in here. I can grab this, right? Yep. Oh, wait, this is still fit to a stockpile. That is why. There we go. I don't even remember why we did that. Doesn't really matter. Now it works. So. I guess it's back to this thing. So this is basically the size we want it to be on both ends. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and another pillar. Good. Whoops. 
and then we can have another pillar in the middle. I think at least. Is this the middle? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, it is. And the middle of this seems to be here. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nope. Good, so we can have another turbine power right there. Whoops. Let's just go and grab that. If we can without hurting ourselves. Good. Don't want those plugs lying around really. So we could have actually 16 large containers in here, but even with just four, I think we might be a bit pressured. But unfortunately, that's all we have time for in this episode. So thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.